Hello everybody, and today I'm going to be showing you a uh, video tutorial on how to increase your Windows 7 virtual memory. Um, this does work with Windows XP and Vista, but it'll probably be a little different for you. So anyways, um, this is specifically for Windows 7 users. Now this will not increase your physical memory. Your, your hard drive memory will not change, but it will change your page filing, which is something that will help your computer run a little bit faster. So let's get started. You're going to click on Start, go to Computer, right click, and go down to Properties. Now this will pull up for all Windows 7 users, and then we're going to go to the Advanced System Settings, and then we're going to go to the Advanced tab right here as shown, go to the Performance at the top, and click on Settings. Now you can either adjust for best performance, this is for you users who don't care about your graphics. Um, but if you do, just leave it on best appearance. Uh, best performance is just going to speed up your computer a little bit. It'll get rid of all your little fancy graphics like I have here. And that's about it. So anyways, in the performance, as we have here, go to the advance. And then go down to where it says virtual memory and change. Now you're going to want to, want to change both of these little boxes here after collect, selecting custom size to 10,000. I have both of mine set already. So all you're going to do after you put in 10,000, just click Set and OK. Now, for some of you, what this is going to do is ask you to uh, restart your computer after you get done doing this, and when you get done, you're just going to click Apply. Um, I don't need to because I haven't changed anything different from mine, so I'm just going to click OK. And then that's all you're going to need to do for that. Um, so now I'm going to show you uh, two more programs, one called Game Booster and one called CCleaner, that are going to help optimize your Windows 7 performance. Um, Game Booster is uh, quite obvious in itself. It's going to be for gaming. So let's search that up really quick. Okay, so here it is. It'll be under uh, IOBit or even Softonic. Um, it doesn't matter which one you go to. So I'm going to go to Softonic and then I'm going to go to the free download and click the free download one more time. Now it's going to pop up down here and for anybody who runs Windows 7 you should already know how to do this. Uh, you just click on this when it gets done and it'll open up your setup. Game Booster is going to shut down applications you don't need to run like Google or, or any internet applications you don't need to run when you're playing a game. It's actually really nice and helps my game smooth out a lot better. So let's search up CCleaner now. Now CCleaner is a Windows optimization and cleaning download which will actually clean your registry errors in your um, computer. So anyway, let's go back to space here. So it's going to be under Periform. It's going to be at the top or right underneath. You click on it, go to download, and then the free version has no support from anything. This one says it's going to make your PC faster and more secure, priority technical support included, and blah blah blah. This will do the same, trust me. Um, you're just not going to get the priority technical support and some of these other things. Anyway, we're going to go from the download from option, filehippo or puriform.com. I'm going to keep it on puriform. Um, you do not have to do this, the email option here, you can just start the download and actually it started it right down here for me anyways. So you're just going to run that and I'll just give you guys a little example of what CCleaner will do. I'm sure there's a couple application errors that I have right now. So I'm opening CCleaner, yes, and now I'm going to go to registry and scan for issues. So let's see how many pulls up. Actually no issues were found for me. So my computer is good to go. But anyways, it'll find Windows Services and all these little fun things right here. And as uh, when you scan for issues, it'll ask you to fix select selected issues. It'll ask you to back up your registry. I recommend it if you have over 100 different application errors. If you have over 100, you need to back up your registry. It's just safe. Um, CCleaner doesn't usually ever have any problems. It's just it's just better safe to do that. Fix the selected issues it tells you to fix, and you're good.
good to go. So this has been my video tutorial on how to increase your Windows 7 virtual memory and plus a little bonus on how to increase your gaming rate, uh, FPS rate, and also optimize your computer's um, cleaning software. So that'll be all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment.